Well, today we, we always support the Castledown Ale Drinkers Tin Baths event and uh, we discovered that the Bass Brass Band movement in, the, in Europe and the UK was doing a relay to coincide with the, the torch relay. And the, it's called Brass the Baton and there are five conductor's battens, uh, each of which has a different colour representing the rings of the Olympic the rings. So we've been fortunate to be involved in the green baton relay and the, bat the baton, as I said, has been brought in, as you've seen, by the Port St Mary lifeboat crew, who always support this event, and we're delighted to involve them and that they've been able to do it for us today. And of course, the Tin Baths is one of the world's quirkiest events, as we know, so I thought it would be a great opportunity to promote the event, brass bands, the lifeboat, and hopefully bring this to the attention of the public more, and what brass bands do, because that's what it's all about, really. Brass bands do an awful lot in the community. Over on the Isle of Man here, we're very fortunate. I think we have at least eight bands who are very active, some of which take part in competitions off the island, and some of them take part in community activities like ourselves. We have over 50 engagements in a year. So now you've got the baton, do you keep it for a while or does it go straight on? Um, no, we will probably use the baton tomorrow afternoon as well for a concert in Ramsey in the Murick Park at three o'clock. And then the day after, I'll be arranging for it to go back to the Iron Gorge Festival in Shropshire so that another band can use it there.